What is up, everybody? We are back with some more Stellar Blade. We just got back from the Wasteland. Defeated the boss there in an area where we were only using our drone as a gun. So we didn't get the chance to use our blade, which was a pretty interesting area, I think. Um, interesting choice, and I think it makes sense to get you used to using your gun. So I thought that was pretty cool. So now we're back. Uh, we're going to go ahead. I think I already checked if we can upgrade anything, and we can't. So... Go ahead and should we advance the story now or should we I'm thinking about just going back to the wasteland and clearing up any of the missions that we've done and kind of just like finish up exploring the wasteland before moving forward. Oh we got a phone here that has not been activated. We also got a poster here that I didn't never checked out. Keep calm and trust us. Attention citizens 1. Attention citizens, we have recently discovered that a certain organization is at large, which insults the Prophet Oracle's reputation and spreads falsified rumors about the Sentinels. Please be informed that this organization claims organizations claim is not true. Citizens of Zion, do not be swayed by malicious instigators and put your trust in us. We, the Sentinels, promise to protect Zion peace, Zion's peace with our lives. Sentinel Captain Man. I don't trust them. I don't trust the Oracle. Technology's taking over. Alright, let's see what's going on now. As expected. Did not deceive me. Excellent work, Adam. I'll leave this one to you as well. Let's go to the hyperdrive. Secondary drive energy injection. Initiating activation. Now. Yes, what we're doing is really worth it. So you think? Talk to Oracle. All right, let's go back. Once again, thank you. Now it's your turn. Wait, he will give you an answer. Like a supercomputer. There's a sewage treatment facility and a train graveyard in the old city center. I am detecting the frequencies of an alpha nativa coming from Matrix 11. Matrix 11. I will forward the map data to the tetrapod. It will guide you as you attempt to travel to the alpha nativa's location. Thanks for helping us. It means a lot. None of this can compare to all that you have done for Zion, I assure you. <clears throat> I wish you luck. Okay. Nothing malicious there, it seems like. I thought he was going to ask for more things to us to do. So what's next? Talk to Oracle is done. Talk to Adam at the safe house. Alright guys. Okay. I was gonna say that. I'm just gonna fast the travel over there. Seems different. Ooh. I see more people. More signs. I told you. What we've accomplished has been well worth it. I don't think we'll be catching any more sideways glances. Well, that's great to hear. To be honest, I was getting a bit anxious. I'm heading over to the Tetrapod. Why don't you take some time to enjoy the new scenery? Alright, that is pretty cool. Oh, whoa, whoa. 
And guess we can head over here since we haven't been. Mother Spear Prayer. Prayer meeting guide. Let us pray, brothers and sisters. May we find salvation, Mother Fear said. It was the most beautiful thing she said and we all must cherish it. A long time has passed since the final war and our only hope is her prophecy in this fit filth ridden surface crawling with blasphemous nativas. Our faith prevails, it will endure, it will stand, it will not go astay, astray. For she does not lie, we will find our place in space soon. Pray my good family, peace be with all my brothers and sisters who come to visit. For more, in for more inquiries, find Francis in the bookshop next to the Zion entrance. I don't think we've met Francis, have we? Let's see what's over here. Hey, there we go. Zion 1. The Memory Tower, a facility to com commemorate the memories of those who have been lost. A week of mourning has been declared to mark the tower's completion. All citizens must pay their respects. So, I believe we've been to the Memory Tower already? But the Sentinels have announced that maintenance on Memory Square has been completed. There are plans to resume transit. The Memory Tower has become operational as a result of this maintenance. The Memory Tower prevents data corruption in Memory 6 and can store memories semi-permanently so that memory data will be transferred to the colony on the day of salvation. Prophet Oracle declared a week of mourning, stating, On such a blessed day, rather than rejoicing at the thought of returning to space, we must pay tribute to those who have gone before us. Zion is a city built on the backs of many. We must remember the courage, courage, devotion, and sacrifice of those who departed before us. We look forward to your active participation in the week of mourning. Interesting. I'm gonna head back here real quick because it seems like there's a crate. Oh, but we need a pass code. Alright, so. Yeah, there's not. At least from what I've seen, it's not too different. uses the subtle resonance from the alpha core to pinpoint its location. It can't reach a super long distance, but you'll find it useful once you head over to the location Oracle told you about. Wow, good work. <laughs> You're gonna put me out of a job. I thought you were already out of a job. <laughs> you little brat. Thank you for helping me out all the time, Lily. And just one more. Can you turn around for me? See what we got. Done. What have you done, Lily? I customized the power distribution of the body cell. Doesn't your body feel lighter? Something does feel different. If you try jumping, I bet you'll notice the difference. Double jump? <laughs> hey, there we go. I was wondering if we were gonna get something like that. But that feels so much better, honestly. Better take the alpha signal meter over to the tetrapod before heading out to Matrix 11. Oh, look at all the dust. 
Don't think we can upgrade anything. Alright, cool. So let's speak to Adam and see what so, the next part go? of the main mission is. Matrix 11 is an underground facility. The search perimeter is extensive, so make sure you're prepared. Okay. Now we're not you going yet. Ready. I'll be here. So first, let's go ahead and start doing some of the side missions. We can do one of them right here with Lily. Take the alpha I believe. Meter. So about Enya. Eve, it looks like right. All right, never mind. I'm I guess sure I haven't collected everything. Well, okay. I wonder what the it's vanilla artificial intelligence. It can be implanted into. We're going to have to investigate. All right, I'll keep that in mind. All right, so we still got to do that one. Let me take a look here. All right, so we need more extreme nano elements for that. All right, first customer. I believe this is the one where we're gonna be able to. I guess we can fast travel. We're gonna be able to style our hair, I guess, like get a haircut or something. I don't know. Here. Huh. I guess those weren't just empty words. I never thought you'd really help me. Thank you. Now will you style my hair? Please don't make it dull. Oof. I guess that really got under your skin. <laughs> now, shall I begin? So we can change like our bangs. <laughs> That's kind of funny. Oh, and for these we need to actually spend money or er, spend materials. Even change our hair color. That is interesting. So for now, it seems like this is the only thing we can get. So I guess we can go ahead and do it. It's always a pleasure to style your hair. Okay. Well, how do you like it? <laughs> hmm. I'm not sure. Adam, what do you think? I... Uh, I don't know. Don't ask me. That's funny. Hey, okay. So at least we got some of that. I was like, I don't know if that was even worth it. Where is your... I'm sorry. I think I kind of just like it how it was before, honestly. That looks a little weird. Perfect. We'll just go back to how it was. Not bad, go with a red hairstyle. Alright. Let's get out of here. Let's see. Next. Deliver the recovered trunk to Kaya. So this is the one where we went to check on her, the motorcycle of somebody that left it in like a junkyard or something like that. Well, that's a bit of- Oh, uh... Kaya, this is the trunk, right? The bike isn't salvageable. It's too badly damaged. Oh, that's fine. The trunk is much more important to me. It, it's just, it belonged to my sister. When I first lost it, I didn't know what to do. I thought I'd never see it again. I can't believe you found it! You're amazing, Angel! It's nothing. I'm sure you'll help me later on anyway. If you ever need help again, let me know. Yes, Angel. Alright, there's that. wonder if there's anything Kaya. that Is your... oh, we can buy from you... her. No, that's... I'm sorry. That was... It's alright. My sister. She's alive. She'll be back soon. I have... Okay. So I could buy some of this. 
Yeah, let's buy some of this stuff. Bonus gold drop. Cover HP when defeating an enemy, that's pretty good. Just keep going. And then we have some of these that we can go back to the bulletin. Alright, since we're here, we got this guy. Side Angel. mission. The looters took my sister. Please save my younger sister. Where are the looters now? There! Down the alley! Wait right here. I guess we'll do this. Wait, so where? Wait. This way, Angel. Keep quiet. Just follow me. Hmm, what's going on? Unknown presence. Well, I'm confused now. Zion is a boring place. Have I used this yet? Hey, I haven't. Down this alley. Really? Did I just get scammed? Boy. Oh shit. happy to call you the angel just because you came from the colony. Aren't we humans just like you? Well, why should we have to dig through garbage, cower, and hide from the Ativos just to survive? Why? Many treasures, but none more precious than the materials inside your bodies. And with the body as state of the art as yours, need I say more? I've got to say, it'll be nice to hear a thank you for a change. <laughs> Whoa, this is not what I expected. Are you all right? Focus on me. Can you do that? Adam. These are black market merchants. I didn't think they'd approach airborne squad members. <sighs> this can't be. I've never seen. Oh this shit! Before. It looks like Natibas weren't all humans had to worry about. <sighs> Pretty dark, actually. Let's get you back to the safe house and do some maintenance. It's like trafficking for body parts. 
not actual body parts, but like whatever's inside of these angels. Uh oh, the calm and soothing music again. Hey, I mean, mission accomplished, I guess. Oh, wait. We can talk to her? Why can we talk to her now? We better take the alphas. Something need fixing? Yeah, they both cost it the exact same thing. Where was he going? He was. Saw him here. Oh, he's up there. Another trap. So you brought me all the way here. What for? Hey, relax. I'm just the messenger. Take this. What? This is a terminal. Don't know the code. This device is locked with a quantum passcode. What do you expect me to do with it? You're asking the wrong person, Angel. I was just told to give you that terminal in secret. Good luck then. H hey! There's nothing more I can tell you. It. <laughs> All right. Might as well track down all these new missions first. you angel now why would an angel visit the last gulp here for a song perhaps i could ask you the same i thought you'd be busy collecting scraps or trading like the other scavengers yeah that's what i'd be doing if it wasn't for my partner screwing up he entered the forbidden area trying to find a jackpot for the yeah so this is going to be for the next area store. mission for the next so area he says that place is the devil's lair that's why there's lost treasure in it. Devil's Lair? Yes, the Devil's Lair. An underground chamber echoing with the roars of Natibas. I even got near the place to find my partner. But I turned back like a coward. After that, I couldn't possibly continue life as a scavenger. I can't stand idly by if Natibas are involved. I'll help. What? Why? There's nothing in it for you, but I won't look a gift horse in the mouth. I just want to know if Tommy is alive. All I need you to do is find him. Fair enough. Send me the location. I swear, every single one of these missions where we need to try to find the other person, Tommy, they always end up dead. Dead or alive. Right. Yeah, the forbidden area. Oh no, this is in the wasteland. The forbidden area is in the wasteland, so look at that. Makes sense that we're collecting. It's a good thing we came back to collect these before moving forward. Huh. This noise. Renovating, perhaps? You can't just barge in like this. The store is closed. Oh, Angel. Uh, wh what are you doing here? I heard some noise. Is everything all right? 
Oh, uh, I, I didn't know that. Sorry to bother you, Angel. As you can see, this is a general store. I, I trade all kinds of items. But I can't do business, not anymore. Why not? Well, I had a treasure in the store. I, I thought of it as my guardian angel. It's a gilt bronze standing Buddha. An old, valuable treasure. But my daughter Arin stole it. That item protects this store. She... She knows how valuable it is. I bet she wanted to sell it at the market. I see. Tell me what I can do to help. Thank you, Angel. Uh, if you terrify the scavengers at the market, they'll tell you where it is. Terrify them? Yes, Angel. Please, bring back my gilt bronze standing Buddha. Please, I beg you. Fine. I'll see what I can do. Okay. Hello there. How are you? May Mother Sphere's blessings be with you always. Uh, uh... Yes. Meeting you like this now, it's Mother's doing. She's answered my prayers. If you came all the way to the ground for the sake of Mother Sphere, I'm sure you'll at least listen to my request. A favor? I have a brother, a good man, and as devout as I am, if not more. Unfortunately for him, he wasn't able to make it out of Ados 7 before it was submerged. Ados 7. Now, it would be foolish of me to think he managed to survive. However, he didn't. I would at least like to have his book of faith. It was precious to him. To us, that book is even more valuable than our lives. My brother was a librarian at the library in Ados 7. Knowing him, he stayed at that library until the very end to protect it. Please, try to retrieve the Book of Faith from the library. A gold circle is engraved on the cover, so it shouldn't be too difficult to find. All right. Thank I so. Rest assured, Mother will protect you along your journey. A little bit more backtracking than the Wastelands. Looks like we're going to be going back to Ados 7. So that's what's down here. Angel? Angel? <sighs> Stop. I'm not an angel. I'm... a child. Angel? The nice man over there told me to bring this over to you. What's this? Dunno, but I accomplished my mission. Bye-bye! <laughs> I got to see the angel up close. That's suspicious. Sending a random child instead of coming to me directly. What is this program? Request letter. Please forgive me for concealing my identity like this. I heard it's impossible to go to the lower part of Ados 7 and Patillo's Plaza because of the flooding. There's a recovery program to control the broken sewer device. Use this to get to the water to get the water out of the plaza and look into warehouse 77. If you head there, you'll see why I'm asking this of you. Patelos Plaza. Oh. Is this related to that flooded shopping mall? That's a pretty vague request. Seems like a trap. Could be. We'll know when we get there. Hmm. What to do? Yep, we'll see. If we are gonna do it. Two missions leading us back to 807. Up a little right then. So we can complete this one. And there's a lot that we can do now.
Okay, so... Can't do these yet. I mean, yeah, let's go ahead and to to the unit. request all these. We'll request them, the and then I'm not really going to read them right now. I'll read them when I actually do them. Kill me. I, I don't know what to say. Wait. I refuse this? Oh, it's because I did that, right? I was the one that read it. Wasteland? I can't just let this pass. Overclocking the brain? That sounds intense, to say the least. Alright, we accepted a bunch of quests. Of course. What brings such I'd appreciate it if you stopped talking. <laughs> Got anything new for me? More information? Hyper 2. Mega corporations wanted to maintain their monopolies efficiently in their respective economies. The key, is, the key to this was logistics, energy and raw materials, manufacturing and assembling production, and consumption of all these processes. Spreading across, spread across the earth and orbit needed to be combined into one and managed as a whole. It was then a large scale global fulfillment system was created. On Earth, hypertubes played a major role. Hypertubes are just as the name suggests, giant tubes that transport cargo at high speeds. Magnetic uh, levi levi levitation, magnetic levitation tracks were placed inside the inner walls, allowing cargo platforms to move in all directions. It must have been a magnificent sight to see tens of thousands of cargo platforms zipping by like bullets. Like other relics of the past, the hypertubes are now in ruins. However, it is said that some sections are still operational. Rumor has it the entrance is in the west of the Great Desert. You could use it to quickly move to a location of your choice by following the tracks, but it also means you'll have to take a risk the risk of flying face first into a pile of scrap metal. In the west of the Great Desert. Yeah, so maybe something we can come across. Oasis. In the mid-21st century, Earth was in a dire situation in which climate change was irreversi irreversible due to implementing only carbon neutrality. Humanity had to handle the disaster it created by building a system based on terraforming to improve the global environment. Underground transportation and circulation facilities, later called the Matrix, became a part of it. The Matrix helped combat climate change, but when the colony extinction occurred, it became a death trap. The deep underground facilities were no match for the solid ground. Seconds after the colony module fell to the ground, the matrix collapsed and an earthquake swallowed the entire world. But the world is full of irony. It is thanks to the old matrix that an oasis was created in the great desert of, of ash, dust, and ceramic shards. Water flows from the sunken underground facilities and spews water up to the surface ground. You'll know what kind of place it is, and what you'll find there if you go and check it out yourself. <laughs> I had a good time. Let's leave it at that. That was it, right? There's nothing else. Good to see you, Angel. Hello. I much prefer yes. All right. It's been fun. And see you later. All right. All right. So, go ahead and see what we can do here. Oh, we can do this wisdom puzzle. Yep, right here. Alright, so let's take a look at the mission, see if we can figure out the code. 37, 21, 928 equals 928. All right, let me see. Just try some basic stuff right here. Got my calculator out. 
double try. Let's just see what 37 plus 21 gives us. 58. Mm -hmm. Nope, that doesn't really help us. 3 times. Try 3 times. Mm, this one might be a little bit trickier. Now, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. 37... Oh, wait. No. Wait, 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 wait. Three. Oh, it's so frustrating because I feel like I have an idea, but... Yeah, I think I'm going to have to give up. Dang, I, I really feel like... Yeah, let's just skip it. I have, like... Maybe if I come back to it, I'll, I'll notice it. But, like, I feel like I, there's something there for with what I was thinking, but... I can't get it. So this is in the wasteland, this is in the wasteland. So, all of our missions, except for one of them where we can go to the junk, the junk shop. I don't know where the junk shop is. The guy made it sound like it was close to the shop. Get around here? Kaya. Kaya? Oh, Angel. I hope she comes back. I have felt as though she's closer to me. That's... that... Kaya. Oh yeah. Can I ask you? She me? does know. Sure. Have you met a girl named Arin? Arin? I guess you've heard the story then. What story? About her and her father, Lyle. They were really close. They cared for each other. Though they were financially struggling. But ever since Lyle got that standing Buddha, he changed. He considers it his guardian angel, and even believes that it embodies Mother's fear. Over time, his obsession grew stronger than ever. I guess that's why Arin decided to get rid of it for good. She asked me if there was a place to hide something where it would never be found. <sighs> Seems like this is something personal. So, where is she? Scrap Plains. There's a building with a dome roof. People call it the villa. It was built by strange drones. Nobody goes there. Perfect place to hide something. Okay. Thanks. Alright. Go to the villa. There's a couple of these are that are in Ido Seven. How about we go to Ido Seven and there's no, yeah, I think we maybe we can complete all of them that are in Ido Seven. Oh, you're here. All right. Why is she glowing? Who knows? Ma now I'll connect the repair. Okay. Guess we gotta take a closer look at exactly where. Go to the flooded, I just saying flooded commercial sector. Where was that? So it seems like we are here. Oh, see. Oh, it's in there. Yeah, I do remember this place actually. Let's see if we can parry this guy.
Yeah, so it's right here. We're publishing the information. The passcode is 1228. It was the Legion's secret cash box. Good thing I came back. All right, cool. And we just completed another side quest by gaining that material. The drop pad. Pretty sure I know exactly where. Wait, search the library. Asked me to find the book of faith. Oh yeah, forgot about that. circle engraved on it the book of faith i used to read that all the time let's see the words of the devout felix therefore we will do mother's fears bidding on earth as it is in heaven that's crossed out it's all a lie we've all been tricked it wasn't the monster monsters killing us but mother's fear whoever's reading this listen up i felix a once devout believer, do so declare Mother's Fear is a false god, a living calamity trying to kill us. If you draw over the contents of the Book of Faith. It's a lot easier to keep faith when you're not staring death in the face. Uh, now we won't return yet, so we're still doing other stuff. We're this is a little bit far. Yeah. Hmm. Earrings? The they belong to Lily. Everything useful has been stripped already. I just realized I don't think I read any of these. It's like more focusing on where they, they go. That one. The same thing. Let's just go to fast travel. And try to find the closest one. Alright. So yeah, we found the right place. Here we are. Oh yeah, and I do remember this. Combat? Ah, uh, really? That thing? Alright. Go ahead and finish this up. like a whole new area of the game now. Search for Warehouse 77. Whoa. Well, this place actually seems kind of big. But you know what? Let's go ahead and we'll actually cap it off here. I didn't think it was going to be this big. I thought it was just something quick. 
So we'll go ahead and rest up. I know there's a... Yeah, here it is. A little camp right here. Go ahead and, and also level up where we can. So let's do this. Beta recharge right now is a pretty good thing to level up, I think. Like I said, I, I really like this uh, this one specifically, so... First strike of a triplet, triplet also stuns the hit enemy. Additionally, increases the attack power of triplet. Let's go ahead and do it. We don't need to buy anything either. Actually, let's buy one of these. And let's go ahead and rest up. And like I said, we'll, we'll go ahead and end it here. And then next time we'll finish up this mission. Finish up Ido 7. Um, I don't know if it's for good or if there's will be returning for any other mission. But pretty interesting that a whole new area just opened up here. Did not see that coming. So thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. And peace.